Hello everyone, I will be doing a ColourPop cosmetic haul for you today and I recently received these different look products um, as a gift to me. Um, so ColourPop was having a basically freebie uh, for every, I think, $20 that you bought um, products, you receive a free mini satin lip. So whatever satin lips they had available, you can choose either. I think they had like four of them to select. So I received three of these small um, mini lip ColourPop satin lips. And I will show those to you. But this is just a haul just to show you what I purchased. Um, if you've never heard about Colourpop Cosmetics, they're based here in California. And they're pretty much a, um, I would say they're on along the line of the indie brand that is increasingly becoming very popular um, throughout the world. Everybody screams Colourpop. So, um, they're very affordable, you know, your eyeshadows run around like $5, the lip product $6, um, the blushes around 8 and they have eyebrow, um, you know, highlighters and pressed pigment eyeshadows, you know, the whole galore, anything you want from ColourPop. You know, you pretty much can find it. Eyebrow pencils, eyeliners, gel eyeliners, and collaborations. Like, they're coming out with collaborations, um, which I think, you know, is really cool because it is supportive of those in the beauty industry. And also, um, it's a way for ColourPop to continue to market their um, products. So, let me get into this haul. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So there's eight products plus the three mini lips. So um, let's start off with the new release Ultra Blotted Lips, which these are the um, Ultra Matte versions. And I know there's the Blotted Lip Lippy Sticks. That I need to try out also. So I only um, got so I selected two, and so the first one is called Zuma, and the packaging before I show Zuma comes in this nice box. It has ultra blotted lip on there if it zooms. And um, just a standard white box with a kind of like a metallic emblem uh, with the name Zuma. Comes with the names on the outside of the packaging. And they look like the packaging for the Ultra Matte Lips or any standard lip product that they sell. And that's Zuma. And Zoomer is pretty much a, um, I think a nude along more of the brown peachy range. And I'm just going to swatch a little bit on my arm to show you. So these ultra blotted lips are supposed to be more of a sheer um, version of like a ultra matte lips so it dries down and I guess it's on trend with the um, Asian style um, lip look that they do I want to think in Korea if I'm not mistaken but it's this nice if I can turn my hand here it's this nice rosy kind of like a rosy nude along the mauvey mauvey tone um, so it's got that peachy brown um, type of undertone that I tend to like really much because it's um, looks tend to look very neutral on me as I would say and so that was Zuma 
the next ultra blotted lip that I purchased I keep saying I purchased well I got gifted but I did pick out the colors so um the next shade is double scoop again you know I love my peachy um, coral shades so this is double scoop and this is the color Maybe it'll help if I swatch it along my wrist instead on top of my my wrist area. So they're very sheer, almost like a lip gloss. But they're, again, they're going to dry down to a matte. Very nice, beautiful, I think. You have that sheer matte kind of lip. So this is double scoop. And so that takes care of my two double scoops that I bought. Of course, I have a list of other Ultra Blighted Lips that I would like to purchase. Before I move ahead, I'm going to show you Zuma again so you can see the difference in the color shades from double scoop and again if you're a nude um, type of gal or gentleman gal or boy um, this is the type of color that would be I think universal to all skin shades um, it's just that perfect you know that rosy rosy brown type nude with that brown, slightly brown, a little bit of a pink, pink or peach undertone to it. So I try to give you all enough of the descriptions of color as I possibly can. So this is definitely in part along with like the Ultra Matte, I think Bumble. Bumble is more pink. I would say this is along the part of Possibly nitty, um, maybe similar in color, but of course, you know, all the colors are not going to be exact, but I'm just trying to give you a ballpark of a comparison of what Zuma may look. The next are all matte lippy sticks, and two of them are, no... I think one are one is matte X and the rest are just a matte lippy stick. Matte X is my favorite formula. And I love ColourPop matte. You know, I know some feel that it's too drying for the lips. But, you know, I love a good matte lip from ColourPop. I have no qualms. So, again, this is what their packaging looks like. A beautiful metallic emblem of color pop the lippy stick um comes with the name on the tip of the box this is brink and this is a matte shade you can see that and i'm gonna swatch it next to zuma zuma and brink look kind of similar but there's still a difference brink is more on the more of a pink nude color with a slight brown undertone it has like definitely a brown undertone but it's more on the pink side if i could turn my wrist to show you so this is brink this is zuma so it definitely has that pinky rose um tone to it which I love a good rose like rose mauve like I love all the colors just I can't discriminate I just but if I want to have a nude type lip like these are the types of shades that I would go for so that was Brink again that is the matte finish the next shade I'm going to show you is Lumiere, and this is from Kathleen Light's 
um, collaboration with Color Pop. And again, the name of the packaging is on the tip. If it focuses for you, my camera has not been focusing very well on things. So that's Lumiere. Again, this is from Kathleen's Lights, Kathleen Lights collaboration. And it looks like a nice, um, looks like a nice, another nude shade that has a pink. More of a mauvey, more of a mauvey. This is definitely mauvey, like a mauvey pink uh, undertone. Mauvey pink with a purple undertone, I think. So that's Lumiere from Kathleen Letts collaboration. And so um, a very nice rose pink shade the next shade that I've got is barely there and it is the matte X formula from Colourpop from Colourpop so it's this bright pink like a almost like a bubblegum pink color um so let's take a look at this shade. Yeah, this is very, this is very in your face, bright pink shade. It's very bright, vibrant, basically on the verge of neon pink, definitely neon. So this is barely, barely, barely there. About to say barely X. So that's barely there. So definitely hot, vibrant pink. And again, these were, I want to think this was in the last call session or the clearance session on the ColourPop site. So I'm not sure if they still have barely there available on their site. So they do do last calls and last calls usually they they're gone forever type thing so I'm not 100 you want to visit the site to see if it's still available the next shade is called Chi Chi and it is the matte formula that is the care the color and it's a nice vibrant I think orange shade yeah so that's what that looks like. Yeah, it's definitely an orange. So this is Chi Chi. So for all the orange lovers like myself out there, here you go. It's a nice Chi Chi. Um, so that is that lovely Chi Chi. I love, again, a nice orange, red, red, orange, corals, pinks, purple mauves, like all the colors. I just, I can't get enough, and I just buy them on all types of brands. The next shade is called Frenchie, and again, this is the matte formula. It looks like a red top, but I want to think this is more, we're going to see if this is red or a red orange. Yeah, this is a red. It's like a cool tone red. Like a blue undertone red. Not very warm. So it's definitely on the cool side. So if you're just looking for that classic red, Frenchy is your is your babe. So that's Frenchy. Frenchy. So that's Frenchy. So all these shades are beautiful. Like I, I just can't get enough of ColourPop. Like I love seriously ColourPop. I have the eyeshadows. I have a few blush. I have a few, maybe one or two highlights. But the lippies, I have lippy galore, and I don't have everything. 
The next shade is Poison. Again, matte formula looks like this. And the name is on the bottom of the it's on the bottom of the uh packaging. Brink oh not brink, I'm sorry. Poison is more of a brick red definitely cool tone brown um, undertone um, very almost on the verge of vampy but not quite so it has that kind of like cranberry red but that brown like a perfect brick red this is poison so I have to turn my arm all the way around so that's poison so it's basically a perfect, perfect brick red color. So those are all the colors that I swatch from the Lippy Sticks and the Ultra Blotted Lips. So now let's get into the minis that I receive upon every $20 purchase. You got a free Lippy. So let's start with Dopey. So the minis look like this, very cute little mini size. In fact, I think it would be helpful if ColourPop were to release more of these for um, their customers to try out, especially if they're not sure or a particular color they may want. They're not sure how it's going to look on them, even though they can see swatches and hear other people um, giving their description of it they may not feel 100 so to have a small little mini size that they can buy like in a kit that would be helpful because let me hold this up so i do it all the so that would be helpful for those who are interested in buying the color but may not want to commit to the full price and even though again color pop is on the affordable end which i truly love because you get more for your money um you know, some people may not, may be hesitant to fully commit. So again, this is Dopey. Dopey to me looks a lot like Lumiere. So this is Dopey, an ultra satin lip formula. And this again is, my mind going blank. This again is Lumiere. So Lumiere, dopey. I want the liquid formula because it's too drying. I'm fine with the the um the formulas in Ultra Mask or the Lippy Sticks for just for those who are more more sensitive to the dryness or just not prefer it. Try the Lippy Stick matte versions or try the satin lippy satin lips. Again, this is dopey, the Lumiere. They're very very similar in color. In fact, they look like they're dupes. Dopey and Lumiere look like dupes to me. I mean, can you all see that? They look quite similar. The next shade is Freaking Frat, which I heard is a ColourPop Court favorite. Among the color pop lovers, and this is freaking frat. I'm gonna swatch this here. Freaking frat is definitely along the brown undertone with some pink, definitely a kind of rose brown type nude, like a rosy with like a brown undertone, but in the nude family, I would think. A little more along, maybe of a darker nude. So again, this is freaking frat. And I think this color, these colors will look, I think, absolutely stunning on any skin tone. And I think um, some of the lighter nudes may not look so much uh, very striking for us women of color, especially medium tone to... I would say darker tone. And this next shade is called Scrip. Again, came in minis. And this is Scrip. 
Script kind of reminds me of Monday. I could get away with those shades, but we shall see. And I will be doing a um, video of the lip swatches on my Old Life Beauty Beauty channel. So go look at that video on that channel to see the lip swatches and see how they look on my uh, particular skin tones. So these are all the shades of the lippies that I bought. Again, this is double scoop which is the ultra blotted lip in the liquid formula not the stick version because they do have an ultra blotted lip and a lippy stick version that's not it this is the liquid one so this is double scoop this is zuma that's dried up now this is brink and matte formula this is lumiere and matte formula this is Barely There and Matte X formula. This is Chi Chi, this bright orange. Next shade is, I go get blank on my names. Um, what is this shade? I want to think it's Poison. So you got Chi Chi, Frenchy, then Poison. And then, oh, my arm is hurting. And then you have, um, getting blank on my um, lippies. You have Dopey, you have Dopey, Freaking Frat, and Scrip in the Social Ultra Satin Lip version. So those are all the swatches. Of what I bought from this color pot haul, not what I bought, but what I was gifted to me in this haul. So again, go check my old life beauty channel, and I'm gonna share lip swatches. Thank you for watching. Take care. Peace.